Alright everybody, today I will be talking about how to train the internal strength of martial art. Not our uh, outside uh, muscle strength, but the internal strength. To do that, we're going to learn how to do the meditation exercises. But the meditation exercises is a little confused to understand. I'm going to explain it right now. First of all, let's take a look at what, is this, uh, what does it look like. I believe that you guys have seen um, these kind of images where people just stand there and uh, relax, close their eyes, breathe in, breathe out, and uh, try to be concentrated on doing their own thing. It's not that uh, wrong to do this kind of exercise, but if you don't know the exact way to uh, empty your mind, you're going to end up with feeling uh, tired very easily. And I'm going to explain it to you why. So, um, I'm going to uh, tell you the real uh, meaning of emptiness. What does that mean by true em emptiness? First of all, think about, uh, we're, we're all standing all the time. We stand all the time. We stand when we're waiting for buses. We stand when we're t uh, taking pictures. And we stand when we are uh, talking to each other in a group of people or listen to somebody else uh, while standing. That way you notice that we don't actually feel tired very easily because you don't put any effort in there. There's no pressure in there. You just stand there. You're relaxed. There's nothing you have to worry about. Um, uh, but uh, when you're getting to some kind of position, some kind of uh, uh, things, you're gonna feel tired because your your mind is actually forcing you to think. I am doing this exercise to relax and to empty my mind. Well, then it's not empty anymore because what you don't notice is that your brain actually activate your whole body muscles at all time. Our brain does that all the time. You don't notice that. So any motivation can can unconsciously activate the muscles at all time. So you might you might just stand there and think that you're not moving, but actually your full body is doing the moving while you're not notice. In order to be entirely empty, you have to learn how to shut down your brain. Um, so then you might wonder why do we practice this what's the use well here's some example my student kevin right here is gonna stand his in, into his position doing the meditation as you can see his arm can be lift up very easily then i'm telling him to shut down his full body muscle meaning paying no attention on his full body muscles but focus more on his arms imagine himself that there's something important in his pocket that he has to hold on to it so once he put his mind into the pocket as if he's holding the the, the stuff when when that lifting up his arm as you can see it's going to be very difficult and he himself doesn't actually feel anything he feel very comfortable so which means that while the attention is moved to something else entirely and your full body can be relaxed the outside forces will not affect the body okay. so it doesn't matter if when you're practicing punches or uh, when you're practice with the equipments or practice with your partner if you have this kind of power then once you get into the fighting situation the enemy cannot affect your body very uh, very easily so it's a very useful kind of uh, tool to learn and that serves the whole purpose of self-defense so to re refresh there are three questions that I would like to think about uh, one what is that we're talking about today second uh, what is the true meaning of emptiness and third why do we practice this you can discuss this with anybody, uh, your family, your friends and relatives, and feel free to e email me any questions to the uh, 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 provided email address. Thank you very much and uh, have a good day.